Now we're going to scan the hamstrings. We're going to look at the T-junction area between the short head and the long head of biceps, which is an area where you can get a lot of injuries. So all you need to do is just place the probe in a transverse section and look for these train lines. Here's one train line and here's the other. This column in the middle is your short head of biceps. To check that, you just go up and it will get smaller. And as you go down, it will get bigger. Now next to it more medially is the long head. So this is your long head supplied by the tibial nerve. And this is your short head supplied by the common perineal nerve. Now the T-junction area where you get lots of tears is this region here. And you can see a T. Now if I just heel the probe down or toe the probe down, I will be able to get the fascial plane slightly more parallel and you can see it. So this is the bottom of the T. This is the top of the T. So this is the T-junction between short head and long head. And this is where we need to look for our injuries. If they're located more superficially, they can be a longer time back to playing. If they're slightly deeper, they can have a slightly improved prognosis, but obviously it does vary. So that is the T-junction area of the hamstrings. If you like this video, then please do subscribe to our channel and we'll show you way more videos which will help your scanning.